welcome or welcome back to my channel for another vlog. You fill my head with roses. I can't help but dream away. Standing on a field with you and flowers everywhere. Today is the 7th of February and I wasn't planning on recording anything today. I am just picking up the camera because something happened and I don't know if this will get to something or not. So either way, I'm just going to take you through my day um, and explain a little bit more of why I am starting to record. So this morning I had air birth therapy and I told her about the weird thing that happened with my legs over the weekend and that was really bad last night. Basically my legs have been getting really hard and I've been having, I don't know the best way to describe them but it's like, I don't know if you can see, like this part of my leg that had like bumps and like things like it's all weird and basically i told that to my ergo therapist and she saw my legs it's a lot better this morning but she said it it sounds like uh thrombosis uh venous thrombosis i think that's what it is so basically when you have like blood clots I think that's what it is I should probably look it up but I'm too scared to finding out what it actually is to google it um so she made me call my doctors my primary care doctor's office in the appointment with her and I have an appointment today at um 4 30 to go get my blood drawn to check if I have that or not and see my doctor uh, <laughs> this was not what I thought today was going to be I also have a really busy day I had aerobic therapy at 8 30 I have psych a uh, psychology appointment in 30 minutes which is a video call so it's at home that's all good and then I have physical therapy this afternoon and then after that I have the blood work um so this is a fun day so i'm gonna take you with me through this adventure i don't know what the hell is going on um and i am freaking out a little bit um before my appointment i have been working on editing a video i am still editing the videos from the er even though it was in december and we are now in february i'm trying to catch up on that um, but it's a beautiful day outside, so I'm gonna try to get as much work done as possible while in between appointments, I guess. So let's continue on with our day. I don't think that I'm being that selfish right now You said yourself you'd be breaking your vow I can understand you're tired of this town And I'm not saying that we have to settle down now Just remember this We could have been stardust, same world but without us Something made us, made us find each other out there Made us realize we're more than just stardust Ignore this fact if you must To do what your dreams are telling you to do And I'll be out there looking for someone like you So I guess I should have known You said yourself you want to do this alone Whoa. 
But if your dreams are making it hard to think straight, if you still love me, I can wait, I can wait and remember this. We could have been stardust, same world, but without us. Something made us, made us find each other out there, made us realize we're more than just stardust. Ignore this fact if you must To do what your dreams are telling you to do And I'll be out there looking for someone like you 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 Hi, so it is now much later in the afternoon I have come back home from physical therapy already Uh... I discovered that I am actually very talented for basketball. Don't know from where that comes from, but um, yeah, he, my physical therapist made me do like throwing balls into a basket and I like crushed it. <laughs> like it, it was pretty good. Um, for throwing with an arm that was paralyzed two months ago so <laughs> pretty surprising but also pretty fun to try and work like on coordination with the two hands and on uh, where my arm is in relation to space <laughs> um, to like kind of know where my arm is and all that because that's what I've been struggling with ever since I got my uh, arm back from paralysis so I wanted to like do a little bit of a I was interrupted but what I was saying is that um, my legs are doing better I don't think I explained very well what was going on but basically the past weekend and yesterday, um, my legs have been really hard to touch and like having bumps and like they have been really weird, hot and red and all of that, like really weird and it's signs of thrombosis but today it's doing better. So, I don't know, like, what's going on. I don't know if I had something, like, this weekend and yesterday, and now I'm doing better. So, we are still going to, like, check everything out, I guess. Um, because, like, this morning my legs were still warm, which is a sign. But right now they're not that much anymore, so it's really confusing. I don't know what's going on. Um, but yeah, I'm going in like less than an hour to get my blood work, blood work done. Hopefully it's nothing and I panicked for nothing. But I'm still really scared to like figure out what's going on. So yeah, I'm gonna update once I am back from the doctor. I know it's nothing new. It's so good to see you We do this every day And I'm still so amazed Hi, I am now back at home I am about to get ready for bed But I wanted to do a little update And tell you guys that I am completely fine in the end um, it was just a big scare for nothing. I do in fact have all of the symptoms of thrombosis, but my coagulation in my blood is perfectly fine. No signs that I've had one or that I'm going to have one. So I'm fine and that's a good news. So really happy about that and it is very uh, reassuring, I guess but it was a lot of stress for nothing in the end um so yeah i don't really know what's going on in my legs um uh, probably still like 
circulation issues and water retention not exactly sure what's going on in that um but i might have to wear like compression socks or like compression gowns to try and help that because it's really not good but it's probably just because i am a wheelchair user and i've been sick for two weeks so i i had the stomach flu and the normal regular flu so i was in bed for two weeks and that probably just didn't help with my poor um circulation <sighs> yeah on the bright side i got some more medication for my allergies a uh, new thing to try for pollen allergy it's a, like a spray to help with decongestion uh with congestion for uh pollen allergies which has started for me right now so happy about that and i know what to do about my random allergies that i've been having um like how to record them and how to track them to have all of the informations on them so it was not a visit for nothing i'm happy that i went for the other things and just to make sure because it could have been life-threatening so i'm happy that we cleared that up and i think i'm gonna continue on this little vlog a little bit more for tomorrow because i didn't have a lot for today um so i think it will be a little bit more interesting to have another day so I will see you tomorrow. Hey darling, can I tell you what's been on my mind? Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Hey darling, we could get out of town. See the beautiful world around, wanna see it now. And get in that car Leave a little note and we'll drive real far Let's get out, we can leave this city Let's drive to the open air Yeah, the countryside is so pretty With the wind blowing in your hair We can look back someday
proper update yesterday it was kind of a crazy day all over the place um so i'm doing an update now also i am all ready because i'm going to take my new school photo ideas if you didn't know this last week i went to tour my new high school and i am enrolling and to do the admission process you need and ID photo and mine was from 2018 so definitely not up to date <laughs> so I'm going to take a new one today so that I can actually enroll in the school so I got all ready for that um, but yeah that's basically what's going on um, for today but for yesterday it was all over the place once again um, I had some issues like the morning was fine and then I tried to show you guys like oh I'm going on a walk with Skyla and then I arrived in front of my building I was crossing the street and my wheelchair stopped working um, thankfully I had decided last minute to go out with the wheelchair I use inside which is also a manual wheelchair contrary to my other outside wheelchair that I cannot push by myself because it doesn't have like this one has these and my normal outside wheelchair that I use doesn't it has normal wheels at the bottom like normal little size uh, um, wheels so I was able to get myself off of the street with my dog and then I had to call my mom so she could help me 
and it was a whole thing and then she came with me on the walk because my dog saw her and she was like I want her to come too so that was pretty chaotic and then right when we got back from that walk um Skyla was licking her paw a lot and she had been doing it like all throughout the weekend and the start of the week but it was not too bad but today well yesterday it was bad so we tried to have a look and her paw pads the one that is not like there's like the four here and then there was one a little bit higher up on the paw and the front paw and one of them was like open that's the best way I can say it um so we just called the vet and they said like it's just because of the cold like the paw was um the paw pad was like dry and it split open so she's perfectly fine um we just have to put like some healing cream on to help it um just heal back to normal uh she didn't even, she didn't even need to like go there or anything but yeah it was a lot and then i was able to record a bullet journal video in the afternoon because the sun came out at like 3 p.m um so i had to rush doing that and then i crashed for the rest of the night i got my hair washed um for the picture today and that's about it for yesterday honestly not very much happened but i am going to end this video here i think it's already pretty long thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed if you want to see more definitely subscribe for more turn on the post notification bell if you want to get notified whenever i upload next also follow me on all of my other socials for more daily updates and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!